Hello everyone and welcome to this video. In this one, I will explain the mesh setup for the bike. I am using 3DS Max, but everything should be the same in other software packages. If it was not the same, what matters is the results in the Unreal Engine. So, I have my bike here. It consists of different parts. There is a front wheel and a rear one, a body mesh and a steering handle and two connector meshes that connect the wheels to the body and the steering handle. Any part that should be connected to the wheels but should not rotate, like the calipers or the chain, is going to be included in these connector meshes. First things first, the whole bike should point to the forward x-axis, as you see here in my viewport. The pivot of the body mesh should be on its center, especially if you look at it from the top view, it should be on the center line. And when being looked at from the side view, it should be between the wheels, like so. Let's hide this one. The pivot of the wheels should be on their rotation center. When you rotate them around the y-axis, they should rotate perfectly without any wobbling. Let's hide them too. The steering handle should be completely upright, and point to forward x. I'll try my best to make it straight, and the pivot should be where it connects to the body and rotates around it. And as always, make sure it's on the center line when viewed from the top view. Okay, now these two parts. The pivot of these connectors should be where they sit on the wheels. Let's bring them here to see better. The orientation of these should be in a way that they point to the forward x-axis. And then this symmetric side should point to the y-axis. I will rotate them 90 degrees. And that's it. When I'm done with the parts, I'll select them all and zero out the location of them. Make sure your meshes have the correct names. After that, I'll export them and name the file SM for static mesh. When I import these into the Unreal, they will be named SM underscore, followed by the mesh name. Let's jump to the Unreal and create a folder for our bike. I'll drag my exported FBX file into my content browser and pay attention to the import dialog. First, make sure the combine meshes is off because you want your meshes separated and not combined as one mesh. Then check that transform vertex to absolute is on. This should be on by default and when it is, the Unreal takes the world origin as the pivot for the meshes and disregards the actual pivot on them. This way, if your pivots have hidden rotation or scale, they will not ruin your mesh. Scroll down, and here, you can specify the search location for the materials. So I have created my materials somewhere in this project before, and I want the meshes to search for the same name materials and auto-assign them to the mesh. And this is how you tell the Unreal where it should search for them. And finally import. To check if your meshes are imported correctly, drag them into your level. The body is pointing to the forward X, the steering handle is upright and correctly aligned and then the wheels. Rotate them to check. And lastly, my two connector parts point to the X and the symmetric side is to the Y. You can also check their orientation from these thumbnails. So forward X is to the right. Steering handle upright and pointing to the right, wheels facing you, connection parts pointing to the right, and lastly body to the right. Let's assume I have this incorrect wheel and I want to fix it. I can either go to the modeling app and fix and re-import it, or I can do it using the modeling tool inside the engine. If you do not have this here, go to the plugins, search for modeling, and enable this, and then restart your engine. Then drag your incorrect mesh into the level, enable modeling mode, X form, and edit pivot. And now, you can rotate the pivot freely. I want it to point to forward X, so I'm going to enable my rotation snap, rotate it 90 degrees, and then accept. 
As you can see, it is fixed in the content browser and not just in this instance. So that's another way to correct the mesh rotations. Take care and see you soon.